Good afternoon ladies and gentlemen and welcome to a rerun of Birchwood Grove, yet another rerun. The reason I'm doing this again is because I'm not happy with how the previous recording turned out. Um, because my hand was uh, giving me a little bit of stiffness during the run through. So this time we're going to do it with low wind conditions. We're going to put the wind direction, I think. Oh, sorry, the default was north, but we'll, we'll put it to south anyway. And so we'll make it come from the south. Uh, very firm fairways, very firm greens. Uh, green speed is quite fast. Although not over the top, so we will go fast on that one. Time of day is uh, noon, and the weather this time will be. Uh, I'll actually put a bit of rain on it, just because it doesn't seem to do anything in this game. So let's go. Let's do this game prop. Let's do this course proper justice. And do it correctly this time. Hello there, and a big fat welcome to PGA. So the first hole is a par uh, fired up. And we four are in front of forty two yards. First hole on this one. All you got to do is hit it straight up the middle, and then we'll take it from there. Now, since the last round, I have altered uh, the wedge transition to make it a little bit a easier to hit the uh, here about, I'd say wedge is close. And here, sorry, not here, here is a bit more evidence. I'm going to take the 112, obviously, and then I'm just going to put a bit of D, uh, put a bit of loft on it so it doesn't go as far. That'll play Pins. pin high for us. And this putt for the birdie. Uh, not, a bad, not a bad start if we can get the read. Oh, not what I was looking for. A little bit further across then. And it stops. Okay. Take a break. And after that, we currently sit the second hole, which is a par four, measuring 466 yards. The reason I ended up doing it a second time was because I couldn't That's end up bad. finding the recording. Second that shot here on hole number two. So that's the reason I'm doing it a second time. Okay, back in the fair, we're good stuff. This one's your third. Okay. Should be no problem this time. That's a bit, a bit of a miscalc as well, that one. Alright, good luck good here. Luck You've here. got yeah. 22 feet to go. Yeah. Better far in a little break with forehand. Oh. Well, let's just pop this in and grab a bogey. And Pretty with good. That, we will move on to the next. Let's see what this third hole has Second in store for us. The third hole is about five measuring 594 yards. Tee shots looking decent. 50. And we're around about, I'd say 240, 245 to the pin. 
Now I'm gonna make it over here. It's rather than that. Pretty good effort. If he controls it. Oh, he's unlucky. Okay, here's our third, third shot. In fact, it came off. Means he can have a go at the chip. Pretty well. Nice chip. Nice Fantastic. And here comes a four footer. Played it well. Yep, I knew you had it in a great way to bounce back. Birdieing this one after bogeying the last. Great stuff. Good luck here on this par three. Fall well, this is par three measuring 173 yards. Be an eye nine. One hundred and two. Could have been a wedge that actually. Well, that'll work for you. But not okay. too bad. Two under. If you can sink this. That is fine. <coughs> work, work. Excuse me. Teeing it up on, on the fifth. The fifth. Yeah, that's a solid. Oops, it's not a solid shot. We just need to care, be careful how much we're turning this over. Yeah, that's a good shot. Setting up here 145 yards away. I think that's pretty good. So I'm gonna hit that as it is. Oh yeah, we'll oh, yeah. take, take those all day. all day. This could be a birdie on the scorecard. So far, so, so far, good. So good. You're showing You're us showing how it's done. Four, birdie, birdie of the day, day so, so far. Bolt number, number six. six. At six hole, a shot par four, measuring 316 yards. Gonna be going for it with the driver. One hundred. So it's just obeyed it. Hopefully the rough might take some weight out of it. It's just over okay, back. Okay. Second, Second shot, shot on the six. six. And Good chip in for Eagle. Right in there. How do you do that? As a reminder, this is this course is based on uh, the fictional town of Birchwood Grove in Wisconsin. Sorry, based in the fictional town of Birchwood Grove in Wisconsin. Which is four T's. I'm liking, I'm liking it. it. And was designed by Nick Olsen. And this one is this around, around 180, 180 yards, yards to the pin. Nice and done. Well, I'll do it. I'll take the first 27 minutes after out of the first one. That features Dragon Boris Fancy 9. And we'll uh, add it in 
to this one. But by the time we say it, the two courses are in one. Ah! ah. No good. No good. Here we go for your birdie. For birdie. You're finding, You're finding your way around, around this course. course. That's your fifth, fifth birdie, birdie of the day. Six hundred out of the seven. The eighth hole is the par four, measuring four hundred and thirty yards. It is into the. The wind is helping us this time around. Although oh, that position won't be the best. Out of the fairway and into the rough. No, oh, we're going, to, going the to the sand. That's okay, don't worry don't about it. About it. Di didn't yeah, take into there. account the lie there. Get up and out of here. That was a pathetic shot. That was much better. Because I'm lucky. Okay, okay. Zong's on. And again, I suppose you deserve. Okay, okay. this will save you power. If you make a mistake like you did on the on the last shot, maybe you didn't adjust it at all. Oh my! Oh my. Almost. The Almost a recovery, so but it wouldn't have been deserved, so it's probably get to it, deserves there. For that lack of concentration on the bunker shot. There we, there we go. <laughs> and after that, you've gone, gone up, up to five. To five but but right, let's try this again. Nine. Right, that looks to be good. 185 yards this par three, and plays it beautifully. Distance wise now has he calculated it? Yes he has. Oh my goodness, that could have been From the ridiculous to the sublime, what a shot. Maybe next time. Goes back to six under as we come to the first one of the back nine, which measures four hundred and eighteen yards, and is a par four. Flank by trees on the right hand side. Right and left, so there is a narrow landing area, and he does it comfortably. Finds a gap, and that's going right down the middle. Little play. Don't play. Let's see what you, you have, have on the second, on the second shot, shot here on the tenth. There's a little bit of loft on this. Pretty good. Here's a Here's putt, a for, putt birdie. for birdie. This putt's tracking. Putt's tracking. And, and that, that drops, drops in, in for birdie. 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 again. We are going to hear. Here's a nice, Here's a nice five. five. Well, that tee shot tea looks shot like it will do. Well, in the oh, end, you ended up in the rough. Second shot Second here shot on the 11. Well, can okay, you didn't take that as a but it's unfortunate that time. Setting up for our third, third shot. shot. Pray not to cost him. Okay, here's, okay, a, here's 20 a 24 footer. footer.
right, right time. time. Okay, okay, just a just few more inches to go. And after that one, it's not seven under. This hole is a par four. It's not all that lengthy. 236 yards, the 12 hole, and again, if Nick throws it out here, he's a tempter. Now, I didn't quite aim it quite as I intended last time. Nicely done. I went too far to the left of the green. I think this looks pretty safe. But this should be okay this time. Sorry, too far to the right of the green. This looks like it's going to go off as well. Yep, I was off on that one. That was worse than I had expected. Uh, it's going to be 67-69, so the shot is a flop. This time it did take the line into consideration. This time it should have a good shot. And then now it comes out. Well, it came out slightly hotter than he would have thought. And this is your third shot. And then we control it. At least it was calculated this time, it wasn't just here we go. Here we go. Here we go. without calculating. Oh, it's, oh, getting, it's getting there. there. Oh, oh, too bad. Oh, it didn't hit it. Okay. okay. Another costly bogey takes it back to six on the par. Yeah, as you, you tee off, off here, see if you can stick it stick nice and close. 13th hole is a par 3, measuring 139 yards. Oh, just too long. The line looked perfect. Well, you ended up on the green, it turns out. Long putt, uh, uh, in your future. The line looks spot on. Way better than, Way better than, I, than I expected. expected. This, this one, one is, is unfortunately, he didn't really give him what he was after. Oh no, it's, oh, no, it's really good, good effort. effort. Okay, this okay, one this is one for is the park. Par. And after yeah, that, we're down six under. under. Okay, this okay, one is, is, is par, 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 par four, measuring 328 right. yards. It looks like it's drivable again. But there is a bunker protecting the front of the green, so if I do get it wrong, I'll end up in the in the sand. No, that's okay. Just, just shot the green, two, which should be a four, four, should be a comfortable. Uh, Hit shot. Yeah, beautiful played. Played it well. All right, we'll, All right, take, we'll that. take that. Just four Just feet four left, feet on, left this on this one. one. That's good. So I'm going to move to 7 on that. And yeah, after that one, you got 7 under. Let's see what happens see what on the 15th, 15th hole of this course. The 15th hole is par 5, measuring 532 yards. It's a nice looking nice tee shot. Another, another hole that with a good drive you can reach into this is pretty about easily. Or so pin the pin. only thing you've got to do, which I didn't do in the previous. Uh, uh, in the previous failed run, was hit it hard enough to get it over the water. That time I have, and that time I've cleared it. The only thing I didn't want to do is what I've ended up doing in the sure. back. Right, it's 72 to 74, so it's not that shot, it's a flop, with a little bit of weight adjusted. Oops. This 
Why you wanted to do? Oh, oh. that was that pretty, pretty dialed, dialed in, in, especially, especially considering, considering getting from the rock. Okay, okay. 800, 800 power is your score currently. And you don't get the birdie now there the last time I got four. four. Went there, I got a bogey. So that just indicates. Oh, well, we are pushing this is towards the trees. But unfortunately, it's going to turn left. And it's going to be blocked by a tree. And here is our, here is our second, second shot, shot on the 16th. It's probably where I didn't want to go. But I might be able to get away with it. I think I, I, think lost, I lost it. it. No, it lost it. It lost it. In... It's got away with it in the end because it's actually gone up to the safe. green. Here's a 14 foot putt. Uh, yeah, that's pretty good. Right. It's, getting, it's there. getting there. Yes, yes. That's, that's perfection. perfection. Nice, nice job, nice Bert. Your score your is score currently, is currently nine, nine under par. Under par. Nine under yeah, as we no, come no, to the seventeenth and drivable par four at three hundred and fourteen yards. No doubt drivable, but most of it goes some of it goes right to left, most of it some of it goes left to right. So you wanna be in the middle somehow. That looks a solid hit. I like what, I like I'm, what seeing I'm seeing here. here. Solid piece of hitting. Not spectacular, but Keep solid. Putting for Put Eagle, Eagle here, here now on this par four. And this putt for Eagle. Eagle. And... Turns it over. Is he turned it over enough? It looks good. So the final hole is a long part, a uh, reasonably long part for it, 240 yards. And it's not very often we finish holes on, or finish courses on a part three, so it's nice to see. It is flanked by a couple of bunkers at, in front of the green. It's a little bit of a draw on a long iron and it should get pretty close to this green or to this pin, sorry. Played it well, is it going to come back up the slope? We're on the green with that one. Not well quite. Climbing up 13 foot putt. Could have easily come back off that slope there, but... Uh, that appears to be online. online. And, it, and went it went by, by so, so quick. quick. Just, Just like that, your round, your round is, is over. So there we go, after a 61, yeah, ladies and gentlemen. So that that course is very, very... And with that, I will... Uh, good. I enjoyed, I enjoyed that a lot. Um, now... See you next time. Apologies for having to do it again. Uh, but the previous uh, video was interrupted by uh, vehicles outside. I've managed to get the uh, game recorded this time while the uh, <laughs> I managed to get the uh, the 
round recorded. Uh, and it be a decent recording. I am just going to make adjustments to the uh, irons. Now because I've got enough to do so. And I've got something to add to them. Which is... Uh, oops. I do not want to do that. I do not want to do that either. What I wanted to do was go to locker and then adjust the fittings. Which is, uh, we've actually got three of those which we can turn into an epic. Right. Three uh, transit, well, three transitions which we can turn into an epic. What are we using them on though? We're using one on the hybrid. We're using one on the putter. Okay. Right, so if we trade those um, foreign and get air, unless we get another transition, what do we get it for? We get it for the wedge. Well, there's no, I don't think we do. I think we get. I think what we do. That'll take early transition. Right. So two of which we're using, so we can't really trade them in. Two of them we're using. So we can only really trade in the ones that we're not using. So six. That's the three word, okay. So two six six. Transition ninety three. Tell you what. for that. Hmm. I'm having a wonder as to whether we go and trade these in. I mean what we're gonna need. We're gonna need ideally if we can get the power up to a green. Might be able to get the rest of the transition in that. Right, so yeah, get a bit more on so that to me seems a better op option. Trade all those four in exchange. Now what do we need? I think it's sharp, I think we need, so um that's fine. Driver, shaft, power. Uh, right, eight. Right, that's gone up eight, so. Might be useful that. Power 90. Three power 62. Transition 89. Right, let's fit that. Right, so that'll give him a bit more power. Wedge. 
be 75. Pitching weight, I need 9, I am probably 50. Right, so we'll add it to these. transition head can probably be fitted to the other two right where it's not fitted so a quick fit to the nine iron and the three iron gonna bring this video to an end ladies and gentlemen and as always thank you for your support and thanks for watching